การแอบเห็นได้สมัยที่ไม่ใช่ไม่เคยรีเออรีวิวขับกันแบบเรีวิวลิงก์กันแบบเชื่อตื้นเห็นมือตื้นไปด้วยมือแล้วก็มาเนื้อแบบแบบโอเคตอนตื้นไปใจตื้นไปด้วยมือตื้นไปด้วยมือแล้วก็มาเนื้อแบบแบบโอเคจอมจอมมาแลกวิดีโอ about ดูวิดีโอว่าโชว์ยอมไหมดูวิดีโอ VHS tape question ถ้าเกิดวิดีโอเราโชว์ยอมมาดูวิดีโอ DVD question โอเค and here it is And we're gonna go each of them one by one. Okay. There we go. There we go. I did that so you can see it. Now you got one, then now move it. Uh, you got one, then now move it. Yeah, two or three that really special to my heart. And we're gonna talk about my good time, okay? So put that over there. Baby do go to Hollywood. Uh that's the one that I seen growing up my childhood and uh, um I I uh I'm gonna try to go back and watch it again so I can review it. Um I can go ahead and review it if I want to but it, it won't be a proper review. So I'm gonna try to watch it again and review it. Um, I bought it at a video store. And that's why the barcode right here on the bottom is messed up. But uh, I already kind of liked this one while I was growing up, so that's why um, I saw it at a video store. Um, I had to get it. And here in the the, the the VHS tape of it, my childhood, and, and then the, the DVD that I bought a couple years ago. Okay, do we do go Hollywood? Okay. The next one, do we do in the Lost Nest Monster? I think this is the movie that uh, I bought at Walmart a couple years ago. I think one time after I bought it. So what that means is, a couple years ago, I went to Walmart. I thought it was Walmart. I bought it, went home, watched it, never, never watched it again. Does it mean uh, bad or anything, or I didn't like it or not? Uh, I, I don't know what's my thought. Or opinion on on it. It just that means that I never got around or were never in the mood to watch it again after I watched it the first the, uh, the first time after. Okay, so what that means is since uh, the new Scooby Doo movie coming out this May, it got me it got me in the mood to watch Scooby uh, Scooby Doo movie and stuff again. Okay, I'm gonna try to watch it again for the second time. Since I bought it and watched it a couple years ago, and I'll be trying to review it for my theory leading up to um, uh, Goo. Okay. Another one is I have another Scooby Doo movie that I have on DVD is Scooby Doo and the Curse of the Thirteen Ghosts. Okay. And this is this is the one that another one another Scooby Doo movie that went to Walmart. They had it. I'm like, oh, a brand new Scooby Doo movie. Came fresh DVD. And 
to happen. Um, I bought it. Um, I think after I bought it, I went to walk, I went home, and I watched it. But I never watched it and never again after that. Then, like I said, for the other movie, I never, let me, I uh, hate it or didn't like it or anything. Just that I never got around to watch it again. But like I said, there's a new Scooby Doo movie coming out. I'm more, I'm more, I'm more, uh, trying to watch it again and review it. And give, give you my thoughts and opinion on it. Another, another one that I bought at Walmart. When I went, when I went back to where the movie stuff was, they had it. Oh, another, another, a Scooby Doo movie. I bought it, went home and watched it. And then, then watch it again. What that means then? I think I'm nervous, like I said, I'll try to say this. I'm going to try to watch it again before two come out and review, and review, and review it for y'all. Okay? And that will be for my like, second time watching it. Uh, do we do and Batman and the Blade and the Bow? I really don't know where I bought this at. I don't know if I buy it at the video, like a like a movie store or Walmart. Some people I consider it like a, like a part of the Batman movie collection or Scooby Doo movie. Some people might uh, consider that be both, but like it have Batman in it and up here up here it's so DC and other people might say it's part of Scooby Doo movie because it has Scooby Doo in it. Um, I think every Scooby Doo movie, every Scooby Doo movie that I have on my DVD, I seen at least one time. I think, I think, except for one, I think there's only one Scooby Doo movie that I have here on DVD that, that I never seen. I have on DVD, so I'm gonna cut a watch. I'll cut right when I get to it. So I'm, I'm gonna go back and watch this and before I review it. And I hope y'all can review it before the food comes out. So that's what my back in Scooby Doo movie. Um, um, now for this, for this, I can go ahead and give you my, my thoughts and opinion on this. So I will save this for the, uh, my review of this. I will go back and uh, I will go back and uh, watch it again and try to give you my fresh thoughts and opinion on this. But I'll, I'll save that my thoughts and opinion on this movie for the review. And let me be clear, I did see this movie a long time ago when it came out in theater. But I was very little. Okay, and I was I was little watching one of these great DVDs, two movies. Okay. And some of the freshest, some of the freshest DVD Scooby Doo movies were my favorite growing up. Okay, and I was very little when this, when this came out in fear. And yet, I did see this in fear, okay? And, and I will give you my fucking opinion on this movie when I review this movie, okay? Uh, Scooby Doo 2, Austin and Lee. I think I bought this um, at the video store. I believe I'm not sure. It might be it might be Hot Pack Book or some bookstore or or uh, video store. I'm not sure, and I don't know if the movie came to theaters or not or like the DVD. But I watched it a couple times, and but it's been a couple years ago. I need mean, to watch it again, refresh my memory on it. And be honest, I, I need to watch all the live action Scooby Doo movies in order so I can tell y'all what live action Scooby Doo movie is my favorite and which one my least favorite. And I would and I would say my opinion on it for the review. Okay. Uh, I think while ago there's only one uh, Scooby Doo DVD that I have that I do not. That did not think that I had not seen. And this is the only one. I bought it a couple years ago, and I, I never, I never got around to watch it. 
Okay. Um, now, some people say, why did why they're doing the origin story of Scooby Doo and Scoo when they already done it in this one? And this is called Scoo Scooby Doo The Mystery Begins. I don't know. I haven't seen this yet, so I will watch it. And then after I watch it, I will give my first opinion on it. Okay? So I never seen that before. Okay? I think, I think it just works. I like to see when it came out. I think it came out a couple years ago. It was Walmart that had it. I bought it. And, uh, I can, I can give you my thoughts and opinion on it right now. But I will wait and, and give you my thoughts and opinion on it for the review. But, but it won't, it won't be, it won't be that quick. I mean, that, that much of a review. But I know. I've seen that, and I don't know. Um, this is one of the Scooby Doo movies that I grew up watching in my childhood, and I love watching over and over. Every time I watch it, it gets better and better for me. And this is the one I had on the chat tape, like, and then a couple years ago. Um, probably, it's probably the, the next one I'm going to talk about. So this one I had for a while now on DVD. Not so much the next one, but but if I have a VHS tape and the DVD, whenever a DVD that passed my childhood that I, that I love watching in my childhood, I go out and try to find it on D DVD. That can happen. I had to do. And the battle shape on um, VHS takes my childhood. And then three, four years ago, I went and bought it on DVD. I think, I think, I think this one probably Amazon. Okay. I'm glad I bought it because we, we live my childhood. Um, another one is Scooby Doo. Meet the Blue Brothers, this one, and uh, Scooby Doo and the Battle Chase were like my favorite from my childhood. And, um, okay, I high back one. And this one, I love, I love watching it over and over. This one I watch over and over again. Okay, this is the one where, uh, when VHS tape players went out of style, went out, went out, I couldn't watch it anymore. That was bad. So a couple years ago, two or three years ago, four years ago, I don't know how many years, years it's been, uh, I went and searched for uh, Super Duty Meet the Blue Brothers. And, and behold, I got it. And I watched it and put a smile on my face. I'm glad I, ha I have this. Okay. This one, Scooby Doo Meets the Blue Brother, and Scooby Doo and the Sound Chain, I know by heart. I don't have to watch them again to do a review. I can do a review right now. Pick up a video, a D2 movie, and show you the plot, the story, my favorite thing, everything. I love the movie. And these are my favorite Scooby Doo movies in my childhood. Some of the other ones I have on DVD, I'll have to go back and uh, uh, watch them again. Okay, or, or to do a review of them. The next one is the one that a lot of people consider to be the greatest Scooby Doo movie ever made. And that is Scooby Doo on Dummy Island. And there for a long time, I never had it. On, I never had it on DVD. I just had it on VHS tape. Okay, and the reason why I, I bought it on DVD is because uh, let me see here. Uh, because last year, I think it was, I think it was last year. 
they came out with the uh, Scooby Doo Return to Down the Island. And I'm like, what? In order for me to want this pickle, I had to go back and get the Scooby Doo on Down the Island DVD. I did, and I think I did a review of it and this on my channel. And I'm gonna do it again. These two movies back to back, leading up to uh, two. Okay. Okay. There we go. Okay. And then. Okay. Um. My final Scooby-Doo DVD is the best, the best Scooby-Doo thing I ever bought at Walmart. And that was these three things right here. Okay. And, and tell me real quick before I, can, uh, have, before I have to explain to you. You can tell me what they are. Okay. And they are the original series of Scooby Doo. These right here are, are the, the first three seasons of Scooby Doo Where Are You? I think Scooby Doo Where Are You only ran for three seasons. So this is Scooby Doo Where Are You? Capri Foot, the second season. And then uh, the complete third season of Scooby Doo Where Are You? High recommended. And then, and then uh, the thing that came out for Scooby Doo Where Are You was Scooby Doo Movie, you know, the bet of uh, the new Scooby Doo Movie. The one Scooby Doo became like an hour long episode. They had dead celebrities in it, like uh, when I meet Batman Robin, the Harlem Go Trailer, uh, Three Studios, John Knott, just a joke, just a joke. This, and uh, do where are you? Okay. So that's my Scooby-Doo DVD collection review. Thank you for watching. Thank you.